All right, we are standing next to Adam Cincerillo's bike. This is Brandon Zimmerman. A couple questions for you. Let's start with the plates. The red points leader right. closing down this championship or getting the late stages. Are you starting to feel some of that pressure? No, not at all. I mean, there's always pressure in my position and the rider's position. So I just try to, I just try to act like there there isn't as much pressure and just try to keep it keep it cool, you know. Because if you're shaky, then he's gonna get shaky. He needs you to be stable, right? Exactly. Yeah, we don't want to cause any more stress on the rider, even though you know we're all stressed under the paddock. Last year here, who was more stressed after the frying of the clutch in the heat race? Would that be him or you? That was me, big time. That was uh, that was terrible. Yeah, I was definitely stressing, and that was a mad rush to uh, get the bike. First of all, pushed back to the pits, washed up and then we ended up having to change an engine, so very little time to go to the LCQ and then wash the bike after the LCQ and do a clutch swap and, and get back out there before the, uh, before the gate drop for the main. Looks like he's gotten better at that though. San Diego went pretty well, so I think he's learned to leave this guy alone. Yeah, it's definitely something we, we work on every single day. I mean, like subconsciously really though, you know, just not holding, it, holding the clutch in or, or relying on the clutch too much and especially in, in muddy conditions like San Diego. Now, I know a lot of you guys will build the bikes on different times. You said Thursdays is the normal build, but since we had the showdown back in Atlanta, you had a chance to already get this bike prepped, built, and put away. Uh, how much different is that process, showing up here and not being rushed, knowing that the bike is already ready from a few weeks ago? Yeah, it's great. I mean, I'll still check it all over just uh, for peace of mind, but it's so much better not having to, uh, to build your bike, you know, all day yesterday and then come and set up and everything. So we're all fresh, and it, it feels good. Um, we built the Sunday after Atlanta. And uh, Sunday builds usually aren't that fun because you work all day Saturday, you're on your feet, and then you're waking up bright and early Sunday morning and you're, you're back to it all day long. So it's, it's good. It's good having it all done. Last question. Are we getting the win in Seattle or what? We're locking it in. We're getting it. Getting it done.